have you recently upgraded to Windows 8 and you're missing your start button and start menu? Well, there's a new product called Classic Shell that will give you back the start button and the start menu. This is Paul, one of the techs at Micro Center, and today I'm going to show you how to download that and install it on your system. Let's get started. Okay, so first off, we want to go ahead and open up the internet, open a browser, and go to www.classicshell.net. Click on the download button, and it's going to bring us to an offer or an ad. We want to ignore that and just click on run to go ahead and start this download and install. Let's click on next. Go ahead and accept the license agreement and click on next. Now here you're going to want to go ahead and install all of them so that you can change them at will and find the one that you want to end up with. So take the defaults and click on next. Go ahead and close this window and then click on install. All right, let that install for a few moments. Once that's finished, let's click on finish. So, for the first time, you just want to click on that button and it'll come up and give you the style choice. All right, the style choices are Windows Classic, Windows XP, and Windows Vista slash Windows 7. So first, let's go ahead and take a look at Windows Classic. So click on that and then say yes, and then we want to click OK. Let's click on the Start button and take a look at Windows Classic. There's your programs, documents, everything looks like more of a classic style. So now let's right-click and go to Settings so we can choose another one. Let's select XP, click on Yes, and then click on OK. And then let's go down to the Start button and take a look at that. That certainly looks like Windows XP as I remember it. There's your documents, my pictures, all that sort of thing. Again, right-click and go to Settings. And this time we're going to take a look at the Windows Vista, Windows 7. So Yes, and then OK. And there it is. There's the Windows 7 Start menu. So for everyone that went to Windows 8 and they feel like they're missing their Start button, I mean, I, I got used to not having the start button fairly quickly, but um, I understand not having it. You're used to having it there. So there's how to download and install Classic Shell. If you have any other questions, come visit us at www.microcentertech.com.